Well, hello. How are you? I'm good. I'm tired. And yes, we're not at my desk, but that's okay. Um, I don't know why I went the other way. I'm trying to get it out. Um, I, it's after midnight, so I want to be in the bed. I don't want to sit up, but I want to play. So that's what we're going to do. Now I don't remember what I was doing. I think it was just, yeah, it was like that. Okay. Let's see. I thought today we would do some die cuts for our junk journals to decorate pages with. And I thought we would play with some of these. Now, I am still going to do a... Um, die cut video where I'm reviewing all the die cuts that I've got from Timu, but this right now is just us playing with a die cut. And if you saw my Friday night late late Timu haul, or f yeah, Friday night late late haul, I think, I don't know, anyway. You'll see that I got this. I hate taking these off. I should actually get my jewelry cutter, but I didn't. Where did it go? Hello, where are you? Oh. Um, this makes taking these off so much easier. Hopefully you can see me enough. We'll see in editing how well this does. extra pokies off. Oh, that one is extra sharp. Okay. I don't want those things in my bed. You know what I'm saying? I don't want it in my bed. Okay, so I just grabbed some papers real quick because I wanted to see. Um, I thought this was nice. It's kind of a thick paper. This is actually paper that it's really old from when my husband and I got married. I was going to make um, our imitations with that. Don't mind my bottle of water. Water? Okay. You can't see what I'm doing, of course. Of course. Oh, there's one of the little things. Let's see what I'm going to put you in the back. Okay. I'm going to try to put this on here already so you guys can see what I'm doing. Okay. Oh. I'm going to get these little tabs too. So how y'all doing today? What are you going to do this weekend? I'm just going to... Why did I put the paper down? <laughs> I'm just going to be home cleaning and organizing and possibly crafting. <laughs> I got some new stuff I need to put away. I need to remove some things from the house. You know how it goes. Okay. I'm just getting it situated without moving the die cuts too much because I don't... I'm not in a stable place. Give me a little bit more. There we go. Oof. All right. Let's see how we did. It's, over. it's stuck on my blanket. This is not the best place to do it. I apologize. What do we have here? Okay, so here's the little, like, paper. Okay, let's get the die cut. 
cats out of the way. Okay, we got the little tabs, the little label, and this is the um, little pocket. So you fold it on the little score lines that it has. Right there. Right there. And that's where you will glue. And then you glue it down right there. And then the label, if you want, can go there. It can go here. It can go anywhere you want it to, actually. You can put the little tab onto the paper. And then the paper fits in there. Look how cute. I like that. And then you can just glue this to the page. And you can add all kinds of other things in there as well. And then you fold these on the score line. I like that little fun shape. That's cute. But that's that. So we'll decorate those in a little bit. Right now, let's go cut out some more stuff. But that's pretty, huh? The little silver. I like that. Okay. What die cut shall we use now? You know which one I want to use now? I just hit the mic. I apologize. There's a particular one I want to use. Where did it go? No, no, none of these. Mmm, there it is. My stamps. Okay, but what do I want to use? I don't know. Do I want to use some of this fun paper? I also have this paper. And I even brought out my stamp, like, hey, stamps. My stamp stamps. So we can decorate the stamps we cut out if we want to. This might be fun. Oh, look how pretty that paper is. I don't want to get rid of the paper. Oh my god, that paper is gorgeous. These papers are too pretty. Is there only one of each? Because that is a depressing thought. Can you hear me? I don't even know. My mic is way over here. Goodness gracious. Okay. I think it's only one of each. I don't know if I want to use these. They're too pretty. I want to photocopy them before I cut them apart. It's so nice when these sets come with two of each. And it may have. I may have used the other ones already. Because this is a pretty set. I need to get more of these. These were also purchased on Timo. Blooming in Spring is what it was called, if you want to look it at. Blooming in Spring. Okay, let's see. Maybe this. Let's see. That's pretty. I love the colors in that. Maybe. Pretty colors, too. Same same color scheme. That's fun, because it's like linen. That'd be easy to stamp on. But I don't know if I like the design. The linen. Okay, we'll just stick with that for now. Oh! The bag is open. I also have gray cardstock, but that's boring. Black, yellow, and I think I brought vellum over here too, which I thought would be fun. Yeah, see the vellum? If we cut the vellum out on the stamps too, you could even have it over there. I thought that'd be pretty fun. I wasn't sure what I was going to use the vellum for yet, but... 
I wanted to play with it. That's what I mean. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm so excited to use this one. I'm not even kidding. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, I just barely. Just barely. Don't roll away. Here we go. I always get so scared that it's not going to cut because I've had that happen. Okay, get you here. Oh, it didn't cut it out? Oh, duh. That's, yeah, that's right. We, that way we can rip them um, out. On there, I don't have my scissors to cut it, but that actually these six by six papers are perfect for this. And then you just cut it along. You just cut it along that, and then it's like a sheet of stamps. And you can decorate each one individually, or you can already have the paper decorated. This is cute. Those will be fun. You can even put it in a pocket like this, like as a gift to somebody. You could stamp them. You can do all kinds of things. Embellish them with little stickers. Oh, how fun. How absolutely fun. Let's try a book page with it. Oh, I like these stamp stickers. Stickers? Gigi, no. It's not a sticker. It's a stamp. Die cut. I was going to say stamp. Lord have mercy. I need to go to bed, I think. <laughs> I don't even know what time it is. I don't know if I want to know. Okay, this will be fun. This will be fun. Okay, let's see. Oh, I can't do it that far because I need to be able to put the other one on top. Okay. Trying to feel what side has. Oh, it doesn't really matter. They both do. Okay, then. Oh, goodness me. Goodness me. Well, even though this is not the perfect spot to be doing crafts, there is one benefit. I am showing you that you can do it in bed. <laughs> oh, that's a hard one because I have it where it's it's humped up a little bit. Ooh. Got it. I'm surprised it's as evenly put on there as it is. Look at how cute that looks. And you can just stick that in some, like, pocket in a page. And all you've done to decorate the page is make a pocket big enough to fit this. And then you stick it in there. Like, say you used an envelope for just a simple pocket. You know, and you just had it, like, glued or something. I don't know. Glued down to the page like this in your journal and then you just stick this in there page is done they've got something that they can play with in their journal you know what i mean i mean obviously you can decorate things a little bit more but like look at how cool that is that is so stinking cool i love that i really hope you can hear me i really hope you can hear me oh i, did, I forgot that i had these these would make pretty stamps all right, we're using all the stamps. We're just literally die-cutting the stamps over and over again. We need to stop that. Okay, I'm going to do this one. That's cool. And then we'll move on to another die-cut. Hmm. 
Put your little cute paper butt in there. Mm. Okay. I'm excited for these. That's probably why I was so quiet. I just wanted to make sure I got it through. And yeah, I know I put it in the middle, so I'm going to have to cut small bits off or you could just leave it on a square for people but look at how pretty that's going to look when you decorate them like stamps and then if you decide to decorate them and you know rip them out you can and you can use it on things which I'll show you but that is fun that is super duper fun I love that one okay which one are we going to use now let's put these aside Die cuts. Where are you? There you are. Okay. Um, I can do the file folder. Oh, my leg is trying to fall asleep. That's not good. But the file folder is so big. Hmm. I also have tags, which might be fun. Be great if I didn't drop things though. And then we'll decorate these things and put them on some pages. That'll be fun. Okay, so I just gotta punch these out real quick. These are usually pretty easy to take apart. Oh my, there's so many of these. Man, this came with a lot. I didn't even realize it when I was looking at it. Oh, this is a cute little filigree, like, detailed pocket. That's a really cute pocket. Ow, my fingernail got stuck in between the die. Oh, my foot is, like, totally, my foot is totally falling asleep. And I don't know if you can hear me. I was talking so low. Now you probably can't see me. Okay. Get off of there. Okay. I hate these little buggers. And you should usually have, like, the little plier things. The, I use the jewelry pliers usually. That works pretty good. Oh my god, there's so many pieces. I don't even know where to start on this sucker. Maybe I'll start with the pockets. Those are cute. Oh, do I have to... Ay, do they all come apart? They do. Okay. That. Okay, we're going to start with those. With this. Oh, these come apart, too. Oh, this is like a little piece of paper that goes... Fits in the pocket. That's cool. I love when they do that. This is a tag. And these are those little hole protector things, you know? When you punch a hole and you used to put those around them to make them stronger. Do people still use those? Those are so cute. They, I thought I saw some on Timu and they were quite decorative looking. Okay. Got all these little bits and pieces here. Mm hmm Come on down. No. I literally put my hand there and they just went on the bed instead. Ugh. It's 
to where I don't want you to be. Luckily, this blanket will come off. I feel like my mic is so far away. I just, I really hope you can hear me. Because I'm not trying to be yelling in the house right now. Okay. Oh, slid it right on through. Break on through to the other side. Okay. Let's stick with these little corals. Let's get another one. Um, let's do this pretty one. That one's nice. Okay. And I said I wanted to do the pockets. Right. Okay. Why did I pull the paper there? Okay. That. That. Don't slide. Okay. That. I hope that I can fit all these. Oh, maybe if I do that. And like that. That. Okay. Let's try that. one came out a little bit oh I should have put the paper down you guys because look at the white side has the like threading area it shows through a little bit on that side but not much oh that's a bummer I didn't even think about that actually Ugh. why is it sticking to my board calm down dang and then a sliding. That's cute. I'm so bummed about the... Because now the score lines are... Well, they're in a fine spot for that one. Okay. There's the little paper. Little paper. And that pretty little envelope. Look at that. That is adorable. Okay. Let's see how these turn out. Take that, you just fold them on the score lines. I'm trying to see. It doesn't look like there's like a bunch of stitching lines on that one, so that's good. And you're just folding it on the score lines, and then we'll be gluing it to the paper, to the page, you know, or whatever we're doing with it. And see the little paper fits in there? Isn't that cute? And this one... See, if we would have had it folded over, we would have, well, no, they have them a little bit on that side, but I feel like it would just look better if I would have done it the right way. <laughs> so pay attention to any embossing that may be on the die cut, because the embossing is also part of the design, and you don't want to miss out on part of the design. Okay, get back. This is a cute little pocket. Isn't that cute? Okay. And then we got that. Oh, this was to be like, you could, oh, well, you could do the white side if you wanted to. It's supposed to be like the double layer on top of this one. So if I wanted to use the stitching side, I could decorate it with maybe pens. And make it a little bit more bold and then or even distressing you know I, I hope you can see that anyway so those are that that's those i guess is proper or better okay i like those those are cute all right and these are just big old honking tags these are Big old tags. Big old tags. This one's cute because it has the hole in it. So we'll do that one. 
Is there space on any of this paper? Probably not. Right here, maybe? Um, just barely. Is it worth the risk? No. Probably not. Fine! We'll use that for something else. Um... I'll just grab one that's similar. I'll put this one on too. Might as well have two. I'll put these cute little dots on there. Oh, excuse me. What are you doing? What are you doing? Putting the paper down this time. Try not to move it too. Then I move it too much. Okay. It's cute. Cute. I'm moving it all over the place. Drop the die cuts. That's okay. Okay. Oh no, one tried to fall. You're not allowed to do that. And then one fell. Proving me wrong that it is indeed allowed to do that. Okay. So here is one tag. And here is the other tag. Now, if you cut them out with thicker cardstock, they'll be less flimsy but because it's a die cut you can cut out cardstock or plain paper and then glue these to it and have the same exact cut and not have to worry about it so that's nice and see the little protector dots how cute are those and they just go on to little holes see look at that what's like that anyway they're so little, they're going to get lost. Hello? Come on out now. It doesn't want to, I don't have my, there it is. My little roller. Ah! Oh my goodness. These little boogers are so small, they're just going all over the place. Okay. Oh my gosh. What in the world is going on? So many things moving around at once. Okay. I think we'll do maybe one more. Oh, we'll do this pocket. This is pretty. These are these are fun, these these easy pockets. And you could just make a bunch of these. And have decorations for days. For for a while. You can have decorations for a while. <laughs> That there. And I think I have. No, that's not enough. Darn! Darn it! I was getting ready to start singing Rocky Horror Picture Show. Damn it! Damn it! I love you! It's funny. Anybody seen that movie? Oh my gosh, I used to watch that all the time when I was a kid. Not a kid, but like a teenager. Um. I like that. That's kind of cool. And these papers, I got, I believe I got these off of Timu as well. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> okay, let's put this down this way. Oh, we're just going to go all over the place. Huh? We're just going to blow like the wind. But yeah, I used to watch it when I was a teenager all the time. I loved it. Um, I used to dress up like Columbia. Yes, back then I was... Still sporting wigs and costumes and dressing up like characters who sang. <laughs> but, um, I loved it. I loved it. I thought it was just so fun. I loved a good musical. I still love good musicals. I love show tunes and things like that. So, I probably should have put it, like, more 
off to the side. Again, I centered it too much, but because then I waste it. I have to, I mean, I can still use it, but it just is not as easy. Okay, so I don't know if you can see that. It's got, um, like, the folding lines. I should have done it the other way, too. What a, what a dingleberry. I should have had it where the words were going horizontally, not vertically. So I'm just folding along the score line. See how nice and easy it folds on those? That's what I love about die cuts. And see, before we glue it, we distress it. And now you've got a cute little pocket that you can just glue to a page. And where do they all go? Stick things in it, you know? Stick a tag in it. And you'll have like a ribbon hanging off the tag. Like super easy, you know? Stick stickers in it so the person can have them. Just fun stuff like that. Okay. Let's make another one of those. I'm so sad that I did the paper the wrong way. I wonder if it would work the other way. That's a cute one. Let's see. There it is. I thought I lost it for a minute. I wonder if it would fit. Oh, it's not going to fit that way. That's why. I mean, it would barely, but I don't know that I could get it to stay like that. I wonder if I could tape it to it, or if that would just destroy it. I'm going to try and fold it. Because maybe that will help hold it in place. Yes, that's wishful thinking. But I am a wisher. A dreamer, if you will. Stay. Stay. Work. Ah. That was fun. <laughs> Almost broke a nail. Okay. Oh, that hurt. And then the die cut came out. And look, I still have that other piece of paper that I folded. And oh, look, it's the right way. Oh, my God, it's upside down, y'all. <laughs> oh, my God, I'm so ridiculous. What is wrong with me? Upside down. Horizontal, vertical, I'm all over the place. But, I mean, it is like one in the morning, so. It still looks better vertical, even if it is upside down. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is ridiculous, you guys. Okay, well. Okay, I think we have time for one more die cut. And then we will start decorating said die cuts for the journal. Do I want to do... I still keep pulling out that folder. Oh, this is another one of those, like, pocket folders, like the one we did. I don't want to do that one. <laughs> that was a fast decision, wasn't it? You know what might be fun? What, you ask? Maybe doing a folder with vellum. Nice little see-through folder. We all know I love clear organization so I can see what's inside. I think I'll do the big one. In vellum. Don't you think that would be fun? Ow. Ow. Okay. Don't you dare now. 
Maybe I'll be smart and I'll put it not in the center of the paper. You know? Oh, oh, oh. Nice to know that the die cut moved with the paper. I'm intrigued. Oh, God, that makes me feel like it's just going to break. There she is, y'all. We did it. We made a vellum folder. Oh, look, it's got the little score lines. It did not score on that side, though. Okay, so maybe, is that the end? Would that be? Yeah, so let's... I don't have my bone folder. Help me along. So I hope I do it in the right spot. I wish there was a center score line. Oh, well. That would have made it really nice. Is that the right? It's hard to tell because it's see-through. You got it. Oh, look at how cute. It's a see-through folder. I'm going to put all my stuff in there. If I could find all my stuff. And look, you can see what's in there. And that can be on a page in a pocket. And it can hold things. You could, like, do letters and decorate it, of course. But look, that is cool. I like a vellum pocket. Oh, my God. And if you wanted to, if you wanted to get really crazy, see this line right there? You can actually stitch along the line on the side and make it a true pocket, you know? This is cool. This is cool. Okay. Well, this part we will end here, and then I will get everything cleaned up and ready for us to for us to uh, decorate what we've done and uh, get them put into some pages and see if there's anything else we want to do. Oh my God, how fun are these stamp things? And then you can have the stamps loose and you can put it in a little pick, little envelope. It's kind of like the glassine envelopes, you know, that I hauled not that long ago. Um, see, this is just so cool. I put everything in there. Oh, that's so nice. I love an organized moment. I love that. Um, but like the glassine envelopes that I hauled. Not that long ago. But yeah, this would be a good way to make those. I probably shouldn't have cut out the... Or folded all the pockets because it makes it not flat inside my little folder. And I can't get these little guys out because I don't have my pen. I wonder... Yes, that is thick enough. Perfect. Oh, but it didn't take out the little... It only took out the dots. What do I do with the dots? I can maybe save them to decorate with. But, ugh, I need one of the little thin sticks that I've taken out of all these things. That would have helped. Well. Well. Now what? Stop. Aha, that will work. Right? I hope. No. I was hoping that would fit in that hole. I have the little brush that cleans out the dyes that get stuck like this. Ugh. But it's put away. I didn't think I would need it. Oh no! I'm making a mess. I'll just have to wait till tomorrow on that one. When I have the wherewithal to go dig that thing out. 
We don't need them right now, so we're okay. We are okay without you. I'll just put you away carefully. We got more stamps. More stamps. Oh my god, I love this stamp one. I kid you not. I stinking love it, you guys. Okay. Alright, I'll see you in a hop, skip, and a jump. Hop, skip, and a jump. <laughs> Did you hop, skip, or jump? Because here I am. <laughs> I'm just popping in to tell you that the decorations will be in part two, and that will be posted tomorrow. So I wanted to tell y'all to have a fabulous morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are, make it a good one, a happy one, and a crafty, crafty one. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.